but maybe I'm okay. So frowny face question mark this time. Yeah, maybe. You might be getting used to this. Maybe it's not that bad. Or maybe I'm just playing a low tier, so it's fine. Maybe I'm playing a low tier? Oh. Dude, Wario's Wario's not low tier, but not definitely not high tier. Have you seen that second hitbox of Nair? It's yeah, it <laughs> connects it's into It's disconcerting that it exists, and it does have some good combos, but it's significantly smaller than Wario's body. Wario's a lot of, like, setups that if you don't know about them, chances are you are going to explode. Yeah. Um, After a minute and 50 seconds, quite literally. Oh, yes. He just boots all over you, and you die at, like, 50. It's crazy. Yeah, yeah it's, you know, the, it's the best, like, the best trump card of sorts in the game. Uh, nice turn on down tilt by freaking Dill, getting him a good 40%. Yeah, triple up air off of that right there. Uh, <laughs> the turnaround cancel right there. It's a tech, movement tech you don't see from a lot of characters, but it's pretty much universal along Wario mains. Uh, allows you to sort of do any action a lot quicker with a little bit of extra momentum from a turnaround. Good back air right there. Mewtwo's fair was safe on Power Shield there. Yeah, so Milk is a, uh, is a Bronx player. He usually plays with like okay. Cassius and Otacon and 809, uh, which really explains like how he is as good as he is. New York has right, a yeah, lot those are some of good sleepers. players. Yeah. New York just has a lot of sleepers where they're like, yeah, I don't come to anything. It's fine. <laughs> I'm going to come out to a local and just like do really well. And you're going to be like, who the heck is Milk? <laughs> Does neutral get up spot dodge for the second time so far. He's got the bike up here. Let's see what he can do with it. Just gonna, oh, gonna, probably gonna throw him back off stage, but Dill's able to mash out after two pummels as we see the, maybe the best crawl in the game. <laughs> Partial to Rosa's as well, but that's a good one. <laughs> as the bike sort of warps off stage right there. <laughs> so you get hit by the explosion, not by the shadow ball? Yeah, and we get the Nair grab there, that will seal out the stock. But, uh, he does have full waft online, and Dill sitting at 91% with a very light character. So if he can get this first stock off without waft, this is a very scary situation for Dill. And that down air will kill over near the side. Uh, it's a very strong kill move. And it launches sideways. It does not spike, does not launch up. It launches almost directly sideways. Good raw bear right there. You see Milk was looking for the, uh, the get up so he can try to do something with his bike. And that was actually a re-grab. Dill jumped from ledge and went all the way across the stage. Milk was able to punish it with a dash attack. Uh, he re-grabbed on the other side. <laughs> you see that sometimes characters going under a stage like Smashville. You don't see it very often from characters going above. Yeah, especially oh. on uh, FD. It's kind of really big. Yeah, it's, it's a big stage side to side. That up air will take it if he can get one, but not able to connect that one just yet. On oh, Milk. Looked a little bit scared right there. Jumped right at him and then air dodged rather than going for an aggressive option. This game's still certainly not over, though. This is the point where you have to weigh, um, do I want to get the first stock with Waft or do I want to try and save Waft for the second stock where you, I might be able to use it? Yeah, I think that's the best thing to do. He DI's wrong, probably expecting a back throw there. Uh, fourth throw is Wario's kill throw, but he was closer to uh, the back throw side of the stage right there. So the DI mix up working out for Milk. And this is not far. Oh, uh, good combo right there. So but Wario's a big boy. He's not going to die just yet. He's so fat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right there we see again this yeah, version of parrying the Shadow Ball. Milk has to choose between dying or taking 6% damage. And personally, I think he chose correctly. Yeah, me too. So one more grab will probably take it, uh, even with Wario's weight. Yep, that's going to be And stock. that's it. But uh, this yeah, is a character you can't count out. <laughs> And Milk looked pretty solid for a lot of that game. <laughs> he seems to have the matchup knowledge. You see him deflecting those shadow balls. Uh, with an air grab, just sealing that first stock away. Dill didn't seem phased by any of Wario's tricks. He seems to have an idea of the matchup, even though we don't really see Wario very often here. And yeah, the late Nair, not safe right there, but doesn't get fully punished. Instead, the tech chase. Resulted in the end of the game. And the Sheik, is that from Dill? or Yeah, yes. that's from Dill. So switching characters, even though that went pretty well uh, with Mewtwo. This is a bit surprising. I guess probably the stage pick is going to Smashville. Okay. So uh, Milk trying to counterpick stage. Dill switches to a character who does better on this stage. And the thing here, Sheik, a character who doesn't have the best kill power, but has such a great neutral that she can really keep Wario out all the time. Uh, at the same time, that can be a stressful way to play because 
Unless you can get one of these Smash Bill off the side combos. Wario's probably going to live a very long time. <laughs> it's one of those little baits that most Sheik mains use. But you can definitely bait out the bait reaction, the bait's bait. To get like a double bait and then get like a good punish on that spot dodge. And right here we see... Layers! <laughs> We see Milk uh, looking for those combos, the falling up air strings. Wario does not have a whole lot of combo starters. Uh, falling up air, one of the best ones, but even then, not a whole lot of extended follow ups. More of a character who takes his stray hits and avoids you until he can find a big opening. We see the turnaround cancel. Ooh, turnaround cancel, dash attack, setting up there. You can see, wall, uh, you can see uh, Milk thinking when he got that air dodge read that that could have been a waft and that would have killed if he had gotten it, if he had it ready. Yeah, uh, he didn't even have half waft online quite yet, though, I don't think. Yeah. Uh, I was right on the border, uh, so I wonder if that was what he was thinking during that. Uh, 55 seconds, you get half waft, which is certainly a legitimate kill move. Uh, so half waft already online, uh, full waft about 25 seconds from now. And still able to get that stock with the bouncing fish, and now looking pretty solid. We'll see if Milk can make a comeback. Of course, if he can take this stock, he'll definitely have Waft online. <laughs> oh my god, it exploded. Screw this bike in particular. <laughs> All of Wario's getup animations are so silly. A good string here by Dill again, just really walling him out, taking advantage of everything. Oh, he goes for it right there. As Dill continues to dominate this matchup, oh, no. and oh, no, he's still alive. Oh, was that an error or was that intentional? <laughs> we'll never know. <laughs> Wario has very good air mobility. Uh, I think he's the best at the game at like changing directions in the air. Something along those lines. But regardless, very, very good aerial mobility. He goes for a dare grab right there. Uh, not quite going to work. Just goes for a landing dare. That one's not quite going to work out. So I did not see the clock when he used that last waft. But he's probably about a minute away from actually having waft online again. Um, so we'll see if he can get the stock off and then just sort of hang out until he has the kill power again. But the up air, not quite going to take it. <laughs> and the down air. Again, that move will kill near the ledge at this point. Can we actually... <laughs> wow, are you kidding me? Wow, what a setup right there from Dill. I'm surprised he didn't grab armor through all that. Does grab armor have like a cap on it? Because bike does a lot of damage. I don't believe it has a cap. I, do, I believe it's uh, based on Is it timing. invincibility or? Like it's basically, uh, okay. it's super armor based on exactly, <laughs> what? Grab release? Are you trying to do some brawl stuff here? Yeah, that, that looked like a brawl moment, but didn't get a combo out of it. Uh, Backer's still not going to kill Wario alive at 192. So, Milk could still secure a stock and then maybe 20% more, and he could win this. Yeah, Sheik is very light. We'll die to Waft super early with max rage, but the Forder is going to kill across stage. 192%. Uh, and that's that's the thing about Sheik. You know, even if she doesn't have the kill power, sometimes you don't need it. Out neutrals him very well. Dill was playing neutral extremely well, just not giving Milk any openings right there. Yeah, letting, uh, letting Sheik get an early lead on you is just. Super painful, dude. Yeah, it's just she's hard to approach. Right there, just mistimed it a little. He was at the end of his throw animation because he's out of the, uh, the throw armor by then. And <laughs> right here, we see Dill just waiting in the corner just and then falls just... with the fair. Uh, he was trying to run away from him for a turnaround cancel right there, got caught DIing away. So uh, that's probably all the Wario.